Oh, good morning vlog fam, it's Janine. Welcome back to my vlog channel. It is currently 9.19 and I set my alarm to wake up this morning at 8 a.m. and I did not do it. I literally set like five alarms trying to get myself to get up and it took me a full hour to finally get myself out of bed. Cause I went to bed at two and that was probably not smart of me, whatever. So I'm gonna go for a run today and then um, I have to finish up filming my Halloween video, which I did one of those, I'm really excited about it. So I have to film one last costume in the intro and outro and then just get to editing and then tonight, I'm celebrating a friend's birthday, we're going to a place called Pete's Piano Bar in Dallas somewhere, so that's exciting. I was supposed to go to Boston today and I ended up canceling my trip, it just wasn't like a good thing for me to go. Um, I've been just traveling too much and I really wanted just to stay at home and work and film some videos and just get an order and not travel because this trip wasn't necessarily for business so I just thought it wasn't the smartest thing for me to do. So I decided to cancel it and hang out with some Dallas friends, family, and etc. So I'm kind of bummed about going on the trip but at the same time I'm like I just know that the, the, that was the best decision for me. So anyway, um, I'm gonna go downstairs, make some breakfast, and get to this run. I also just kind of cleaned my room. It was a disaster last night, so that's something I was doing last night was just cleaning it up. It's still a little bad, but it's not nearly as bad as it was before. So this is what happens when your roommates go out of town. All their packages start stacking up. Anyway, also, quick update on our floors. This is what it looks like right now. Here we are. So this is where I filmed my video, brought my mirror down from upstairs when I filmed. But um, yeah, so if you guys remember, our floor was ruined, so we got a new floor. It has to apparently, like, the word is it has to acclimate for the next two weeks, so it gets like settled in, the wood like sits properly. So for the next two weeks, it has to do that, and then we're gonna stain it, and then we have to move out for that because we can't walk on the floor after it's stained. It's a little bit of a pain in the butt, but that's okay. So yeah. Let's make some brekkie. I like about my house is like, I can just use, on Spotify, I can just tap. Okay, okay, Apple Watch, I got it. I can just tap and be like, oh, play music here. So in the living room, I can be like, play music. And I can put on my music. I was listening to Carrie Job upstairs. I'm just gonna put some Elevation Worship on, that's my favorite. I got my retainers when I drink coffee because they don't, they'll get stained otherwise, so. This is like my exact facial expression when I drink coffee, I'm like. <laughs> I'm gonna pause the music, hold on. Okay, so for breakfast I'm going to do oatmeal and strawberries. When I go on a run I kinda wanna keep it light, so I'm gonna do oatmeal and strawberries. And then when I come back I'll probably make some banana pancakes or, I don't know, something hopefully healthy. So while my water is boiling, I wanna show you guys two things I've been taking every single morning. I've been taking the GNC Women's Ultra Mega Daily or Dietary Supplement, it's a gummy vitamin, and for energy, metabolism, support, supports healthy hair, gluten-free, and it just has a bunch of great vitamins in there. So I take two of these every single morning, they're chewable, which is what I love. And so probiotics, I take this every single morning, the guy at GNC told me to take this. Basically, it helps with your digestive system, but there's a bunch of benefits as well. For example, it boosts your immune system, preventing and treating urinary, urinary tract infections. Not that I have that. Improving digestive function, uh, managing and preventing eczema in children, fighting foodborne illness. It also helps keep the good and bad. Like there's certain types of bacteria in your body that are good and bad, and it helps flush out the bad ones and keep the good ones so that your body runs properly and functions healthily. So. I take this every single morning, and it also um, helps you break down the protein in your body. Like when I take protein powder, sometimes that you're supposed to be able to break it down, so this helps kind of break it down and you be able to digest it better, so that it works better in your body. So I've been taking this. He told me to take it every single morning when I work out, so that's what I do. Have you guys been listening to Demi Lovato's new album? I'm not normally like a Demi freak at all. And I think Morgan like really got me into her. And her new album is like so good. I've been listening to it like crazy. Like this song, Daddy Issues, 
sound bad, but I mean, this song is so good, and you don't do it for me anymore. I mean, I am jamming to this song. I see the future without you. Okay, back from my run. Um, it was really good. I ran 2.6 miles today. Today's run was not as easy. I just did, I like ran through like neighborhoods and stuff and I don't really like running on concrete too much because it's not good for your knees. And I ran on um, the grass and a lot of the grass was very uneven and bumpy so it makes running a little bit more difficult. Um, oops, my music is still playing. Anyway, so here's my running outfit today. I have my A6 per usual. These are just my go-to running shoes or the only running shoes I really have. My Nike shorts and my aloe top. So yeah, it was a good run. My face is pretty red right now. I mean, it's cooling down, but it was like super splotchy earlier. So anyway, I am going to now make a protein shake and then get ready and then finish my video. And then yeah, I can't wait for this living room to be finished and the floor is colored again and have furniture back in here, but good for the time being for my video. And here's the protein powder I use. I use the GNC Amplified Weight Bolic Extreme 60 Original Protein. This is the flavor strawberry. It's absolutely delicious. This is the one I use. You can just get it from GNC if you have one around you. I put a scoop of the protein powder and then I put four to five ounces of water. So one scoop in my shaker. Shake this bad boy up. I didn't even really want to run today, but I didn't work out Wednesday, so I was like, dang it, like I really gotta make sure I work out today. And I'm probably gonna try and work out tomorrow morning just because I didn't work out on Wednesday and I try and work out every day of the week, so that was a fail. So I'm gonna try and work out tomorrow morning. Okay, so I'm sitting at my makeup desk right now. I just washed off my body and cleaned my face off, and I'm gonna fix this this thing later. I'm gonna do my makeup really quickly, but I got recently, MAC actually sent me two of their foundations. I'm so amped because I've actually never used a MAC foundation before. So I'm gonna test these out. I don't know which one is my shade. I'm assuming this one because I am a little bit more tan from Mexico. So I'm gonna try that out today and just see how it works. I tried out this foundation yesterday. Uh, Makeup Forever actually sent this to me and I really didn't like it. It flaked off, it got really cakey, especially right here. The powder did not sit well with this. It wasn't full coverage. Um, I don't know, I just wasn't really a fan of this foundation, so at least I know now. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and prime using the one heck of a blot by Soap and Glory. I feel like I haven't done this forever where I just sit down and like try and make it out with you guys. It's been a, a hot freaking minute. So, um, I can't watch with my shade. I'm gonna try this one. Uh, this is their next to nothing face color. And this is the shade medium plus. And so I do have my Invisalign in, so I still do have a little bit of a lisp. Ooh, do we think this is my shade? It looks a little orange. Is this a freaking BB cream? Like, what is this? Shake well. Okay, well that's probably something I should do. I'm gonna put one pump of this because I feel like it's a little orange and one pump of that. Dot, dot, dot. I'm assuming this is like a CC cream, BB cream type of thing because I'm not seeing a difference. Do you guys? I mean, it did say next to nothing, and this one also is a um, invisible cover foundation, so I guess these are both pretty transparent, which is not really what I'm going for right now. I kind of do want the more fuller coverage look, but yeah, I'm not really seeing the appeal of this. Oh, it's pretty orange. I'm going to see if it can cover this pimple right here. Uh, no, it doesn't. Well, I think I've formed an opinion. I don't like it. It's not full coverage and I really do want full coverage. Like, I'd rather wear no foundation or wear full coverage. You know what I mean? There's not really an in-between for me. So, I don't know how I feel about these. I'm just gonna go to my favorite go-to foundation, the Born This Way by Too Faced. This is my kind of foundation. <laughs> there we go. Oh yeah. Oh freaking yeah. Life is good again. The world has been returned to normal. Thank God for this foundation, it's my favorite. If you guys have any recommendations for better foundations, like I have used this one for literally like two, three years or something. Something ridiculous. So if you guys have recommendations for foundations that are similar to this, like full coverage but not too cakey and looks natural, let me know because I love this one. I 
have been obsessed with this Morphe palette recently. Obsessed. Okay guys, so this is my completed makeup look for today. Of course, I did my big bold lashes. No surprise there. And then, and then for lips, I took my MAC Birch Spice Liquid Lipstick. For highlighter today, I used a new one. I used the Master Chrome by Maybelline. This is their shade Molten Gold. Beautiful. For blush, I used today Pinch Me One from MAC. So, that's my look for today. I am now going to get ready to go film downstairs, my last outfit, and then um, edit. Update time, you're probably like, what are you wearing, Janine? So, I just finished filming my costumes idea video, and one of the costumes is, it's lit! <laughs> so I got this idea from a friend. I cut out this thing in the shirt, which I definitely cut it too deep. I almost wanna redo it because I don't like how deep this cut is because like the tatas are popping out. But anyway, so I ironed on this light bulb and ironed on the words lit and I got these lights and strung them around my body. I, I thought it was a pretty witty, clever idea, so it's lit. <laughs> so I'm importing footage now. I finally finished the video. I actually, I actually have to still film the intro and outro, but I'm gonna make some lunch now, so I'm gonna change out of this outfit because I don't really wanna be walking around with light bulbs around me. I'm probably gonna be really tangled right now because I just strung around my body in weird ways, so this is gonna be really not fun trying to untangle these. Surprise, making banana pancakes. More like not surprise because you guys are so used to this. Either like banana pancakes or quinoa salad at this point in my life. I love this song. Just woke up. Is that a guy living in a dream? But never quite make it to the end. Hey guys, so update time. I finally finished filming. Gosh, took me forever, and I also just was lounging around for such a long time because I'm honestly very tired. Um, I've been a little unmotivated, so I'm gonna probably get downstairs, make a cup of coffee, because I didn't finish my cup of coffee this morning, and then just drill this editing, because it's Friday, this video's going up tomorrow. I really wanna make sure it's a good video, and I wanna hang out with some friends tonight, so I'm gonna just spend the rest of the time editing. And yeah, this is the look I wore for my intro and outro of this video. I wore this burgundy sweater from Ferro 21, black jeans from Boohoo, my hoops from, um, I think it's Moon and Lola. And then this is LAX from ColourPop. This is our liquid lipstick. So yeah, I feel very folly. I love it. And yeah, let's go edit now. So it is now 6.10. I have been sitting in the office for a good while. I have a candle lit. I got my editor pulled up. I'm editing my video, my Halloween costumes video right now. It's actually going pretty well. I'm like loving the way it's turning out. So here's a little... <laughs> This shot is so funny, it cracks me up, look. <laughs> I also want to show you guys a package I just got in the mail from Chelsea. Chelsea Crockett, if you guys remember her, she, if you guys know her, she's a YouTuber. Wrote me this letter and she wrote a book, and so here's the book. It's called Your Own Beautiful. And the foreword is by Sadie Robertson, which is a pretty big deal. Um, so this is very, very cool. This is gonna be a great book to read. I'm very proud of her that she wrote this book. It's very inspirational of her. And then she also gave me a shirt that says beautiful on it. And then also a palette. She gave me a naked Urban Decay Smoky palette. I have not bought or gotten an Urban Decay palette and Lord knows how long. So this is really, really sweet and I'm excited to get to try this out and whatnot. So yeah, here's the palette. Beautiful. So if you guys get the chance, definitely check out her book and thank you so much, Chelsea, for sending me your book. Excited to read it. Boom, I got this video done. I'm so proud of myself. And now I can go live my life. I've literally been sitting, staring at a screen for the past five, six hours. Anyway, so I'm gonna make some food really quickly. I think I have a friend coming over or I'm meeting up with a friend and then we're gonna go to this place called Pete's Piano Bar. It's like a karaoke bar type of thing. Never been before, don't know what to expect, but it should be fun. Here we are. 
Good morning or afternoon. It's actually 1:47, and last night we went to Pete's Piano Bar, which was really fun. Um, and then, so we went to Pete's Piano Bar. That was really fun. But after a while, we kind of got bored. So me and Bria head back home. Totally forgot to close the vlog because I was just with her. Like I literally had my vlog camera in my purse, and I said, "Oh, I need to close my vlog," and then totally forgot. Anyway, so I want to make sure I close it now. Um, I'm actually currently right now just chilling in my room because I just uploaded my Halloween video. So I'm just checking how that's doing right now. So Open it out. Yep, just went live. And then the Texas game is on right now. Texas versus OSU. Hook 'em horns. Hopefully we win. It's the fourth quarter right now. This vlog I'm sure has been plenty long, so I'm probably gonna start editing some vlogs and then go work out and then probably hang out with the fam bam tonight. So thank you guys for watching this vlog. I really hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys very, very soon. Peace out, girls, Bye.